For me, it's about the, the, the real kinetic energy behind this kind of short, controlled burst of flame and explosion, which is really appealing for me. I'm a tattoo artist and also a fine artist. So here's where I make my firework drawings. Obviously, tattooing is much more illustrative and, and, and very and almost limited in, in, in as far as like what you're going to do, as far as subject matter goes, and what you possibly can do in the skin and stuff. But they're both very kind of physical and even ritualistic processes. They kind of have these similarities as far as their very direct means of making marks in either skin or paper. I predominantly use one kind of firework with this, which is our jumping jacks. And then I can lay them down in these lines to, to draw lines, or I can contain them within this circle. And then I go back in and add some charcoal to add some ground. And then also I can use the eraser to bring out the white of the paper and then draw that way. I call them spatial drawings because what I do is I burn holes in the paper and then I separate the layers of paper to where they become more 3D, so I'm kind of like turning these two-dimensional drawings into this three-dimensional experience. I went to the Cooper Union, I was taking a drawing course, and so I was looking for ways to illustrate these ideas about space-time and cosmology and stuff, and the traditional materials like charcoal and ink and pencil just weren't really creating the marks I was looking for. So I remember using fireworks as a child and how they used to leave behind marks on the concrete and on the wood that I would light them off on. So I had this idea where maybe I could get some fireworks and put it on a piece of paper. I uh, started using color smoke bombs to uh, burn the paper. So this is kind of still staying within my materials as far as using, using the fireworks. It's very vibrant and it also stays very well in the paper. I enjoy the, the uncertainty and, and the randomness of it and the, and the challenge for me to make this very kind of uncontrollable substance fire do what I want it to do.